Good morning. Happy May 5th, Cinco de Mayo. I came across something in my library this morning that I want to share with you. It's from the book Daily Om. These are inspirational thoughts for a happy, healthy, and fulfilling day. Things that you can read every day. What I came across today is called Grateful Living, Home and Land Meditation. Just as we take care of our friends and families, our homes and Mother Nature take care of us. Our homes give us a place of refuge, a sanctuary that stands between us and the elements of nature and the rest of the world. The earth is an unselfish giver of life and the steward of our physical and spiritual needs. Yet it is easy to take both of these wonderful sources of blessings for granted. She goes on then to lead us in a meditation, something that you can do in the privacy of your own home or do it outside in the beauty of your yard, whichever you'd like. She says, begin by finding a quiet place where you can be alone. Sit comfortably and breathe. Breathe deeply until you feel relaxed, and then read the following out loud. Thank you, home, for allowing me to live within your walls. Thank you for giving me shelter, warmth, and security. Thank you for allowing me to live my life in your womb, for staying strong and sturdy, for supporting me, and for your beauty. Thank you, earth for the land that I live on and for allowing me to steward life with you. Thank you for allowing me to walk upon your soil, cultivate you and live in partnership with you. Thank you for supporting my home and my family. Thank you plants, minerals and animals that dwell on the land that I steward. Thank you for allowing me to experience your beauty and share in the wonderment of life and for the honor of living with all of you on this earth. Thank you for the wisdom and joy you bring to humanity. I honor you. I hope you got something out of that. That's something that I'm going to start doing daily. You know, while we're at home, we just need to appreciate our home, a home that we're able to live in. You know, there's so many that don't have a home, and so we need to remember that and be grateful for it. So I hope you all have a beautiful day. Have a wonderful Cinco de Mayo. Do something good for yourself, and do something good for somebody else as well. And again, as I always say, please, please stay safe. Take care, guys.